another business that we want to focus your attention uh, on is gallery business. Yes, paintings and galleries. Team of our reporters is Nini Longurashvili and Madonna Gasanova talked to Baya Gallery and tried to identify the most demanded and uh, expensive paintings uh, of the Georgian artists. Georgian artists have had their say on the international market long ago and we can definitely say that the global art world knows their works very closely. Gallerist Bayat Ikorizi was our guide through the top 10 Georgian painters and their artworks that are valued in millions. This top 10 includes those painters as well who are contemporary, who live by our sides and while we are presenting this teamwork in the checkpoints might be working hard this very minute creating a masterpiece that becomes a bestseller at Sotheby's or other prominent auction and gains millions. Together with uh, all of this we also highlight some challenges that uh, this, uh, this creative industry has, uh, on, uh, has on the way to popularizing Georgian artworks even more on the global markets. Okay, now this is all from me. The rest uh, will be told by Nini Longurashvili and uh, Madonna Gasanova in the checkpoints. Georgian art market counts only 30 years. Consequently, the top 10 of the most expensive Georgian artists were compiled based on the trade results of international auctions. The top 10 of the most expensive Georgian painters are as follows. Number one is Niko Pirosmani's painting, Georgian woman wearing a lichaki, sold in 2018 for $2,800,000. It's not surprising that Kirill Stanevich follows Pirosmani. Stanevich's artwork Tukani was sold for $2,500,000. The third is Lado Gudiashvili with $1,500,000 for his work by the Black Stream. David Gagabade is fourth in the ranking with $100,000 at international national auctions. Number five is Mera Babramishvili. His paintings has been traded on international auctions for almost six years. The highest cost for his work has reached $80,000. It's noteworthy that the cost of Abramishvili's works in Georgia is much higher. Natalia Yankoshvili is sixth in the list. Her works varies from $50,000 to $90,000. I really regret to see the price of prominent Georgian artist Eleni Akhledyani. The figure for Akhledyani's works were is from $50,000 to $100,000 in Georgia. Artworks of modern Georgian artist Nini Komordebaze, which is eighth in our ranking, started to be selling at Philips auction two years ago. But the cost of her works is between $20,000 to $31,000. Alexander Banzeladze is closing the ranking. The Georgian art market does not have an appropriate infrastructure, which means that museum purchases as well as corporate purchases determine the price index of the artist. Private collections no longer exist. Most importantly, no international auctions are held in Georgia, which is why Georgia does not publish annual statistics. Nevertheless, Georgian works are scattered in many countries of the world. This is how Georgian artists get known. Georgian artists are quite popular abroad. Some foreigners are having this collection of Georgian painters, those Georgians that are established abroad and selling works at place. These artists also frequently come to Georgia and their paintings are purchased by local collectors. Both investment purpose and love of art are main contributors for the purchase of paintings. In case of the second purpose, the cost of the work is less important for them, and they only choose works pursuant to their taste. If we look at art as an investment, one shall bear in mind that the work of art changes over time as it is affected by climate and other factors. At the same time, it is necessary to know the regulations that make a work of art a product of investment. These factors can include how many paintings the artist has painted, how many works the artist has done on the same topic, how the artist's creativity has developed, and etc. Most importantly, one has to be sure of the originality of the work. The pandemic period also results in a price change. However, it did turn out to be good for the art market. 
early stages of the pandemic were quite difficult for our sectors, then the galleries were closed for quite a long time. Online platforms has brought real relief to us. For many people, art has become a space of psychological survival during such a difficult period as pandemic. Consequently, too many collectors appeared during the pandemic. However, for many artists, pandemic has been quite a difficult time. Art sector received important support from governments in many countries and witnessing more support towards culture in Georgia would be appreciated. Art has a therapeutic function in times of crisis, so the demand for artworks at such times is always growing. However, the infrastructure needs to be developed. Gallery owners are asking for a little more attention to the cultural sector.